hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you in Windows application how to add a auto increment serial number to a data grid view control see here the S number column you got a auto increment column serial numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 that's it if you are a first time visitor to my channel please subscribe to get the latest updates just for the time saving I have already bounded an employee table into this data grid view control now my aim is I want to add a new column to this data grid view control with auto increment serial numbers so let's start the coding part and stop debugging first I will add a new column to this data grid view control notice there is a small button at the top which is a data grid view task add column I'm selecting the unbound column the name as number the type is the data grid view text box column and the header column is the S number click add close notice here the S number the newly created column is added to this data grid view control now I want to add these columns the S number I want to be at this first so I can click the grid view task button edit columns highlight the S number column click the upper arrow click OK see here we got the S number let's check the output start and here we got the output after adding the new column as number now we'll add the functionality to display the auto increment column into this s number column stop debugging go to properties notice the fourth button which is events click that one come to the bottom We need a row post paint event. Double click that one. And here we got the data grid view row post paint event. Now let's add the coding part. Data grid view one dot rows e dot row index. The row index is a property, and this row index property it returns the position of a row from the collection of rows in a table. After that, we need cells dot cells. In this cells, I'm adding zero, which is nothing but a data grid view column one. You can add also the column name between the double quotes. Dot value is equals to e dot row index plus one. The plus one is it's a starting number. If I add two, the numbers will be displayed two, three, four, five. Suppose if I add ten, the starting number is ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. The sequence will be like that. Dot two string method. That's it. We have done the complete coding part. Let's check the results time start. See here the S number column, you got a auto increment column, serial numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. that's it. 